Hey guys, so today we're back again with another hockey card video. So I figured I'd get back into it with something kind of nice and fun and easy. So I found these uh, mystery hockey card packs. Also got some overtime packs and some other Dollarama variations. So these are all from Dollarama. And I also have a couple pickups and stuff like that to show you guys since it's been a while. So let's get into it. So we'll start with the pickups. Nothing uh, too crazy here, but... Uh, I am still collecting all the canvas sets, and I do have a couple done now, so I can do some full set videos shortly. But first up, we've got a Legends canvas of Cujo, so very nice card there. Love these Legend canvas cards. So I'm working my way down on the uh, 1920 set. Then we've got a Luke Robitaille from 1617. Uh, just a, oh, I think that's just a base card for Crosby. This one's a good one, though. It's a uh, Connor McDavid second year base card. So for whatever reason, this is just a base canvas card but it has a value of like, I don't know, $30. May have gone down. Um, I got this a while ago, but last time I checked, it was like $35 on eBay. So that's crazy for just a base card, but he is one of the best players in the world. So I guess it's kind of justified. Then we've got a Travis Dermott Young Guns Canvas. I believe that's 1819. That's just a base card. This one's pretty nice here, a Martin Brodeur Legends Canvas. Really cool shot there. And a Niels Hoglander Canvas Young Guns, as I'm almost done the 2021 Series 2 set. Speaking of uh, Young Guns, we do have uh, one of the better names here, Jack Eichel. So that's a 15-16 Series 2, of course. Picked this up at an LCS in Montreal so I could actually like see the card. Um, looks pretty, pretty mint to me. Um, I'm not exactly a grader, but <laughs> looks really good. Looks really sharp and clean. And this was about $85, so that's kind of what his Young Gun's going for. I see them for more sometimes as well on eBay. But I figured I'd uh, complete my 15-16 Series 2 set with this one. So that's the last one I needed. The only one I'm still looking for is the McDavid Series 1, but kind of out of my price range right now. I don't really want to pay for that, but maybe one day. And then the final two pickups, we do have a nice uh, Sergei Bobrovsky embedded endorsements. This one's like the orange or red version, numbered one of just three. So that's from 1920 clear cut. So nice card there for the Bob PC. And we finish off with an enshrinements from the cup. So it's a nice on card auto there. Beautiful design, number out of 99. Bob's value kind of has fallen a little bit. So this card is not too expensive these days, like maybe 30 bucks, 25 bucks. So yeah, there's a card of Sergey Bobrovsky. So now we can get back to the pack. So um, we'll start with the, I guess we'll start with overtime. I've got these from various boxes. I've just never opened them, so I believe the, the autos are one in thirty-six. Yeah. Anyways, you can get autos, you can get numbered cards. So there's hope of something. I've never pulled um, either an auto or a numbered card, but we'll see what we can get in here. It's a nice little bonus set, I guess. So that's a decent start. We got a Jake Evans rookies. Got a Max Jones, Chris Dreger, and a John Tavares, Center of Excellence. Jake Evans is pretty nice, despite the Habs being down 3-0 at the time of me recording this. All right, we got a Robert Thomas, Neil Pionk, ooh, nice blue Alex Stalock, and Connor McDavid, Center of Excellence. So good name to get there. And our third and final pack, this is overtime wave one, by the way. So we've got a Martin Kelt rookies, Alexander Radulov, Yanni Gord, and a center of excellence of Sebastian Ajo. So nothing crazy there, a couple rookies, a couple inserts. Now let's move on to this uh, this 15 cart de hockey, hockey cards. 15 of these. So uh, all of this is pristine marketing. So um, they have various repack like sets and all that kind of stuff. Never opened um, the new one. So I've, I've, I have opened these ones before. They were actually pretty decent for two bucks. Um, never opened these ones. They look a lot better, but maybe I could be wrong about that. So let's get into this one. This is probably all base cards. This was $1.25, so really cheap to get some hockey cards. Anyways, we've got Aaron Ekblad, OPG Platinum, Ben Bishop, um, from SP Authentic. Decent OPG Hockey Highlights of Wayne Gretzky. It's not bad. 
um, Mike Vernon, old pro set, Troy Mallet, Thomas Steen. Oh, nice Yager card there. That's cool. Michael Grabner, Heroes and Prospects, off of the Manitoba Moose. Luke Robitaille, 0506 Fleer Ultra. It's kind of cool. Bob Bassin, another old couple of cards here. Uh, Matt Sundin, Stadium Club. That's cool. Anton Strawman, Pat Elniuk. A <laughs> nice all goalies of Scott Clements and I have this set like 100 times. And what is this? 1516 OPG, All Star of Jonathan Drouin. So there's a buck 25 in base guards. Nothing special. But um, for the price, can't really complain. Anyways, next up we've got these ones. So these say Superstars Hall of Famer cards, special insert cards. So $2, mix of five cards. And um, I have got a numbered cards in here before. So hoping for the best. All right, so we've got a Gabriel Landeskog. This looks like a base card. Nicholas Baxter, SP game used. That's really cool. 1314 SP game used. We've got a Frank Mahovlich OPG Legends. That's pretty nice. Looks like a rainbow variation. Not too familiar with this older OPG stuff, 0809. So that's really nice. And then we've got a Luke Robitaille Trilogy base card from 1314 and a Mike Medano 0809 OPG as well. Or sorry, 0607. So another decent pack there. Now we've got a rookie anthology of Yarmir Yager and the Devils. That is pretty cool. Jerome McGinla, MVP. I believe that's 0809. We've got an 1819 Patrice Bergeron, OPG. A Valerie Bure, Blue Pacific Prism, 2001. I, oh, this is McDonald's. I remember, uh, remember these cards. Had a few way back in the day. And the last card would be a Cam Atkinson base card. So that's those guys there. And we'll finish off with the <laughs> surprise sacks, <laughs> surprise bags. So um, yeah, we've got three of these. It says may contain original sealed packs, card protectors, theme packs. Um, fun theme packs to discover may include the 70s and 80s, memorabilia edition, goalie pack, superstar pack, hall of famer pack, and rookie pack. So let's get into it. So these ones again were two dollars so there's quite a bit of stuff in here <clears throat> let's see what we can find so we've got these guys here i mean this is already like look at this a card sleeve pack um sleeves were tough to find for quite a while and they're bcw card sleeves so that alone is worth the two bucks right there that's really nice so everything else is a bonus We've got 2010 Currents, we've got Superstar Pack here, and a Goalie Pack. So, let's do the uh, Superstar Pack. One Superstar Pack guaranteed. I see Nazem Kadri on the back. Um, but alright. So, we've got Nazem Kadri, a team card. <laughs> Gaten Duchesne, I have never heard of him. And a Matthew Barzal. 18, uh, 1920, sorry, SPA. So I guess that's our superstar. Okay, interesting pack there. And then we've got, this is 2010 to current. So just three cards in this one. So we've got Eric Goodbranson, 1819, just a base, yep. Dylan Larkin and Jacob Voracek, SPA. This is an older SPA, 1516. So that's cool there. And we've got a goal attack. My kind of pack here. We've got a John Van Diesbrook, Chris Terreri, Peter Morazic, and Mathieu Guerron from an older score. All right, so I had some uh, camera difficulties, but we're back with our last two uh, surprise mystery packs. So let's get into them. So the next one is this. It looks like we do have a sealed pack in here. And you can kind of feel the ones that are like softer might have like something like this. They're kind of softer and thicker. But anyways, so in this one, we do have a pro set. 91, 92 NHL Series 2. So that's pretty cool. 
And then the 2000s, another uh, ooh, thousand point club, and the original six. So let's crack into this. Uh, And they don't actually they don't stick which is kind of funny because the newer stuff actually sticks so we'll just breeze through here they didn't have the name on the front um i guess they did have marv albert though fred rogers a couple all-star cards and a performance card so very nice design very nice set there so there's a pro set pack that's kind of cool here's an original six pack so we've got uh, looks like the Rangers. So we've got Tony Granado. We've got one of these nice uh, Parkhurst cards of Mike Dunham. This was a kind of a very nice set they did for each of the original six teams. Pretty cool stuff. We have a Peter Peruca. I remember he was a pretty high, highly touted rookie. Scored 30 goals there in his first year. And then we've got Norman Rockford. So there's that pack. Uh, let's go to the Thousand Point Club next. So we've got Henrik Lundqvist, who obviously does not have any points at all, or maybe a couple assists, but I believe uh, there's one card in here. Yeah, one guaranteed 1,000 points card uh, scorer. So we've got Kevin Evans, another tender, Rajan Lemelin, and Yarmer Yager. So that's quite obviously our 1,000 point scorer there. And uh, looks like he was playing at the uh, Canada Cup there with Czechoslovakia. So that's a cool card there. And now we have the 2000s card. Cards. So we've got uh, Martin Erat from this first edition. I remember this stuff. It's pretty cool. Uh, Radoslav Suchi. Interesting. And Nick Antropov. So three expansion teams. Three uh, interesting kind of variety of cards there. But yeah, that's pack number two. And now we'll hit on to pack number three. This one's way thicker. Um, probably gonna be some kind of like sleeve or top loader in here. And uh, nope, it's actually another pack. So yeah, it looks like we've got an NHL score, 1991. Uh, 15 cards in there. Win special Bobby Orr cards. So it's kind of cool here. They say a total of 1,238 autographed and 270,000 unautographed exclusive Bobby Orr cards have been randomly packed into scorecards. So um, there's also these three, which we'll get into. So it's kind of interesting. I wonder how many millions of packs they made of this though. Probably very, very tough to pull true wax fashion. All right, so we've got Doug Waite, Drake Barahowski, Bill Ranford, Gary Lehman, Yarmir Yager, Ulf Samuelson, Crunch Crew, nice Lady Bing of uh, Gretzky there, and Eric Lindros as well with another trophy. Got Wayne Gretzky season leader, 163 points. And uh, Fedorov led the rookies with 79 points. Garath Butcher, Doug Crossman, Peter Ng, Glenn Healy, and Dave Capuano. So that's kind of cool there. And um, let's get to the packs here. Looks like we've got a goalie pack, a superstar pack, and a 2010 to current pack. So let's rip into this goalie pack, see what we have here. So we've got Sean Burke from an old uh, Donruss set. We've got Rob Stauber from Pinnacle. Nice, actually thick card there. Grant Fuhr on the Leafs and Don Beaupre on the uh, Caps. So that's a cool little pack. Uh, it says here one superstar card guaranteed. So let's see what they define as superstar. We've got Kasperi Kapanen, kind of a nice to have a newer card there. Mike McHugh, Steve Deshane, and this is pretty nice. I've got a Tuka Rask OPG Platinum, so that's pretty decent. It's not bad, just a base card there. 1920 OPG Platinum. 
And finally, we'll end it off with this 2010 Current. See what's in here. So we've got Mikel Granlund, Nick Felino, and Jacob Truba. Guys, nothing crazy as you can see here, just kind of like a smattering of different cards. Um, nothing really to write home about. I will say, I think these, uh, the first premium packs we opened were better than uh, these ones. These ones are kind of meh, like, like they're kind of boring. Uh, the best cards we got were these cards here, which was from the, uh, the pack that had just five cards in it, the five premium cards. This is probably my favorite card here, the OPG Legends of uh, Frankie Mahovlich. But um, yeah, I mean, we did get this card sleeves. This is worth a couple bucks, so that's kind of cool. So yeah, what do you guys think of these uh, Dollarama packs? Let me know which ones you've opened, which ones you've tried, and if you've had any success doing them. So thanks for watching. Make sure to like, subscribe for a lot more hockey card content, and I'll see you guys in the next video.